So there's a general idea that you know buying and selling real estate is a life event. How does that translate to estate planning? Well, that's a great question. I mean, in estate plan, what I typically tell clients is that you should either create or modify an estate plan uh, upon a significant life event, right? The birth of a child, marriage, for instance. And that also includes uh, uh, purchasing real estate, whether it's your primary residence, whether it's a secondary residence. That's a major life estate. It's a major financial decision, right? And so you want to make sure that you have a plan in place in order to protect, not only to protect that asset, but ensure that uh, your heirs are protected in the f your heirs and loved ones are protected in the future.